How's it going there folks? Brandon Fisher here with Fishy15.com and I've got a really sick video for you guys today. I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get a Siri port on your older device running iOS 6. So in this case I'm using an iPhone 4 but you'll be able to use your iPod Touch 4th generation, um, iPhone, uh, iPad, anything that's running iOS 6 that doesn't already have Siri like the iPhone 4S and iPhone 5. So you're going to need to be jailbroken to do this. So once you're jailbroken, uh, go ahead and go into City. And if you guys aren't sure how to jailbreak, um, there are a ton of videos on YouTube. Just go ahead and search um, iOS 6 jailbreak. So now what you're going to need to do in City is go into Sources, Edit, and then Add. You're going to need to add the source. This will also be in the description below. So if you guys uh, aren't, don't understand everything I say or whatever, just go ahead and check that out. The repo is repo.siri. Oh, jeez. SiriPort.ru. After you've added this repo, go ahead and hit Add Source. I've already added it, so I'm going to go ahead and get Cancel. And then you're going to scroll down to the bottom where you'll see a new repo. It's SiriPort.ru. Tap on that. You'll get a bunch of new things here. And the one you guys are going to need to download is SiriPort Original iOS 6. Go ahead and hit Original uh, iOS 6. Go ahead and hit install right up there this will take a while to install I'll tell you that right off the bat it took me like I think like seven minutes to install it it downloads the Siri it installs it does all that stuff for you so you don't have to worry about any SSH or anything like that so once it's installed it will reboot your phone or uh, respring or whatever it is um, then you're gonna go into settings scroll down you've got a Siri port .ru original you'll need to install the certificate it'll open up Safari and open up a web page Go ahead and hit install certificate here, and go ahead and hit OK. And now you're going to hit install. I know it says not trusted right there, but it is trusted. You can see I'm doing it right here in front of you guys, so there's nothing to worry about whatsoever. Hit install, install again, into your passcode if you have one, and then it'll change to trusted, and hit done. And that is basically it. You've just installed the certificate, so Siri will actually run and use Apple's keys and all that good stuff. Uh, you can go into general again. Go into Siri, go ahead and turn it on, enable Siri, and you are set. You have Siri on your device now. I know mine says it's off, but it is, um, it's on. Um, I'll show you guys here. And as you can see, Siri works. If you guys have any comments, questions, concerns, or anything of that sort, go ahead and drop me a comment below or hit me up on Twitter, something like that. Um, <laughs> you guys know how to get a hold of me. Um, if you guys want to subscribe to my YouTube channel, click the subscribe button right up there. It definitely helps me out, and also be sure to like the video. That also helps out the channel. Again, if you guys have any questions on how to get Siri running, or if um, something's not up, just go ahead and let me know here. Um, Another thing, um, in Siri or in Safari here, you can see the Siri server status, so that'll tell you if it's online or if something's up with their servers. It'll say offline there. That is basically it for this video, guys. Um, again, comment below if you have any questions, and go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel right up there. It helps me a lot, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.